What's up everybody? This week, I'm going to Belize with my church. Last week, I painted a mural for my church in Riverside at the Grove. Uh, there's a bunch of guys going, it's like 95 of us are going down to the country. We're going to Punta Gorda and there's going to be a bunch of projects going on, but my specific task is I'm going to be painting, I believe it's two projects. I'm not exactly sure yet. I have to wait until I get down there to be 100% certain, but I'll be painting one at a camp and then one in the city, so I'm excited about that. And it's weird because it's 10 years after an event that changed my perspective and really started me on drawing in the first place. So in 2009, because it's 2019, in 2009 I was a, a freshman in college and I was about to go on a trip to Uganda, Africa. And throughout that year, I had started to study theology at California Baptist University. And my goal was to become a pastor. I, I thought that in 10 years time, in 2019, that I would be the high school pastor for the Grove Community Church. That's what I thought my trajectory was going to be. And so I was studying theology and decided to go on a trip to Uganda, Africa. I go to Uganda and there, I just saw so many things that the inequality of like the, the spread between the United States of America and Uganda is so vast and I crumbled inside. My faith kind of fell apart and it was because I, I didn't have my own faith. I had, I had someone else's faith and, and so it was just this really transformational time of uh, just doubting everything. But around that time, as I had been keeping journals for most, most of that time, my writing in my journal switched to then drawing because I couldn't really express what was going on, there was a lot of angst and emotions and things that I just couldn't, I couldn't understand what was happening. So I started drawing a lot from that time and that was really the catalyst. When I got back from Uganda, I decided that being a pastor was not what I wanted to do. Everything that I liked about being a pastor I could do as a volunteer and I decided to start studying something else and that something else was art. And it's weird that, that art has now become this path that I'm going back and redeeming uh, you know, combining it with my faith, combining it with uh, the career that I've chosen. There's, there's so many different paths that this is taking. I'm excited to go on this trip because this trip is going to allow me to break away from all the commercial stuff that I've been doing in my studio. It's gonna allow me to get away from the city and all the things that I think are super important to me. It's going to give me some perspective and allow me to refresh when I'm when I'm focusing on doing things for, for other people. And my mind, it slowly wants to turn this trip into something like a painting vacation. And that's not really what it's about. I don't know if I'm gonna paint something that's worthy of a portfolio or worthy of showing on social media, but that's not really the point of this. The point is to go, to bless the other people, to have them bless me, to uh, just be engaged in the church. And I, I'm excited for that. I've, I've been really needing this time because these last few weeks have just been go, go, go. I can't wait. So we'll see how Belize goes. And next time you hear from me, I'll be in the jungle. The jungle!